this is full immunity from the coronavirus. So the Singaporean government has just implemented some new rules to counter COVID-19 and we're not in a lockdown but this is a circuit breaker. This means that we're not allowed to do a lot of things and the rules are very clear. You can only go out for essential activities, for work that is considered essential, to buy food, to exercise with an immediate family member and other than that, we have to stay home. Apparently, businesses that are not offering essential services or in key economic sectors have to implement full telecommunicating or stop work altogether. And uh, unfortunately, that is us. That is us here at Titan. We're not considered essential and honestly, I don't want to be very salty about this because I mean the frontliners are more important. There are a lot of uh, more important jobs than doing YouTube videos or advertising or marketing right now, but I can't stop but to feel, I mean, I can't, I don't know, I can't even put my words into words. I don't know what I'm saying. I, I can't even put my words into sentences because it is really sad that um, all of us, we have to stop work. We gotta stop. Whatever we're doing here at Titan, we can't do it anymore. We can't shoot anymore. We can't edit videos here anymore. We can't be here anymore. And as much as all of us want to continue being here, creating content for you guys, editing videos, doing everything that we're doing here at Titan, we all have to do our part to work together to stay home for the next month or perhaps even longer. And that's exactly what we are going to do. And you guys, you know what? Just stay home, all right? Just stay home so that this can all be over. I mean, come on, we can all do without this coronavirus. So today, we will be moving everything home, everything home, and we are going to be trying this work from home. Yes, we want to all work from home, but the problem for us, the challenge is that we can't shoot, and if we don't shoot, we can't edit, and when we don't edit, we pretty much have nothing to do. Nevertheless, we're still moving all our equipment home, our furniture. You know, we won't be back in the office for quite some time, so I told everyone to bring their computers, laptops, desktops, I mean, it's all going home. Literally everything, all home. So generally, it's a pretty sad day here at Titan. I mean, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm feeling pretty sad myself. Uh, I mean, we're all really close friends. We're so used to seeing each other every day. I mean, we talk to each other. We're so used to each other's company and suddenly, we're not going to be seeing each other for a month or even longer. I mean, it really feels sort of like a breakup. Uh, yeah, I don't really know how to put it. It really feels like it's the end of everything. I've, I've, I've never experienced anything like this. I mean, the last time I had this feeling was like graduation when I had to say bye to my friends. I mean, that's the closest thing to this. It really feels sad and I'm just trying to be positive, be positive for the team, be positive for everyone and set a good example. But, but damn, man. I mean, we're not going to be here for... I don't know how long and uh, I mean it says a month but we may be here longer and yeah it's gonna be pretty sad. What you doing Echo? Packing the podcast room. Packing the podcast room. Mm -hmm. So Echo is now tearing off the podcast setup. The setup that we spent so long doing, uh, it's kind of sad to see it all gone now. So we just received a package from PlayStation. You can have it. Definitely. Your t-shirt for the next month. Yes. Ender, what are you doing? We are uploading our final videos from our office today and I'm helping you, good sir, to upload okay. your family video. Perfect. Hey Maxi, what's up bro? Congrats on your wedding. Thank you so much. Social distancing. Ah. <laughs> you should do this. We gotta move out. We gotta move everything out of here. I'm gonna need this. Oh, no. Got the wrong thing. Oh, I gotta take this home. Finally, I found a you for this. Here. All right. Are you going to carry this yourself or what? Yeah. All right. I mean, if you insist. The circuit breaker is making us uh, work from home. Which actually is kind of ironic because that's how we started. How it's actually started. how we started a company. It's how I started a company except for we've grown so big, so many people that it's no longer, YouTube is no longer just doing videos in your bedroom. Yeah. And now that we're going back to that, um, it'll be pretty interesting to see what we're actually going to do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> going back to our roots. See you in the real world. Mm -hmm. Minecraft. I mean. The Minecraft world. That's right. 
Alright, so I'm just gonna make sure that I bring this home. Oh, because, yes. because it will always remind me that I am one of the most outstanding. <laughs> most DP outstanding and DP. And yeah, so I would wanna put it on my wall right behind my computer so that it will always remind me that I'm worth something. What? <laughs> I'm worth something. Stupid COVID-19! Stupid coronavirus! You're ruining my vibe! You're ruining everything! This is my foam sword. I'm not gonna bring it home. I got a real thing at home. Stupid virus! So since the world is ending anyway, I may as well do a TikTok. One last time for old time's sake. This is full immunity from the coronavirus! Ready? Oh, oh god! Uh, yeah. Yo, City, what do you have there? So, as a parting gift before we work from home, we are giving away parting face masks. Parting gift for everybody, alright. Let's go. Thank Come you, on. Thank you. Thank you. Stay thank you. safe. Thank you. Now shake hands. Thank you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> thank you. Oh my god, thanks for the gift! Thank you. For need to pay. Ah. No money. <laughs> what is that? Well, you can't go to the gym, so you need to bring the gym home. Why is that even here? Um, Why is that even here? <laughs> no, because for the past two months, I didn't bring it back. Time to bring it home! I see you've been working out as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, bye, see you in May. Oh, what happened? <laughs> I actually I fell down. Bye, guys. Freaking COVID 19 is ruining my vibe. So, we just helped them uh, move their stuff back so they can work from home. We gotta go for another briefing and say goodbye to another set of people. Uh, I can't believe I have to do this twice. So, we just said goodbye to some of our team members and uh, we let them know the rules from working from home, how this is gonna work, and we help them move some of their stuff into the car, all the computers, the desktops, and weights, and everything. And now I gotta do it again with another group of people. Ladies first team, please report here for briefing now. They're actually here already. They're actually here already. Okay, so as you all know, we will be working from home for the next one month. Along the way, if you guys have any questions, just please feel free to ask. Because this is a, it's a new thing. All of us are struggling to find a way for it to work as well. We've never tried it before. So first of all, work hours as per normal will be 10.30 to 6.30 p.m. with one hour lunch break from 12.30. In that time, we expect people to be at Zoom on the Zoom platform. So download on your desktops or laptops. What is that? Induction cooker! Why do you have an induction cooker? Why not? Teamwork for the family. Bye. Are you joining me in the goodbye parade? Yeah, man, of course. I've been here since the start. I'm gonna be here to the last. Alright, bye. 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 Bye, Mander. See you. See ya. On Zoom. On Zoom. It's time to go now. Gotta leave the office. Hopefully, we'll see you guys soon. This is so sad. I'm saying bye to literally everyone, and uh, who knows when I'll see them again. Hopefully, May. Hopefully, it doesn't get longer. It's like preparing for war. Eh? Our equipment is like our ammo. <laughs> and now it's actually quite sad seeing everything being moved out. It's almost empty inside. Uh, don't be sad then. I mean, you know, in a few years, 10 years, 20 years, we'll have stories to tell, right? I mean, how often does this happen? Hopefully just once in our lifetime. I'm just trying to be positive here, guys. The coronavirus is ruining my vibe! Alright, let's go home.
Hi, so today we have a bunch of new cars from the new class TN41. N41. <laughs> Can you say it? So today, we have the new cars for the new class of N41. Exactly. They are all here today to sign contracts with Titan Digital Media, which is our company. And who better to ask them questions, to get to know them, than our most OG talents, Denise and Jasmine. So the producers have prepared uh, some questions for us to ask each of the talents. But the twist is, they have to go through the lie detector test. So if they are lying, we would know. But shall we try first? Yeah, we should try first. See, I, since you want to go, yeah. I think you should try first, Denise. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Uh, if you could kick out someone from class T1, T5, who would it be? No! Well, I have a name. I can't choose not to answer. Yeah, you can't. Uh, Vince. Because he's really annoying. <laughs> what is this? Is it vibrating? Yeah, it is. But there's no zap. It's just like ominous music. Psych! <laughs> <laughs> It hurts! Oh, I mean. It hurts! It hurts! Oh my god! Who is your favourite talent but you cannot choose that beat? Oh, can I have like... No. <laughs> oh, I don't even know! <laughs> Kevin. Alright. I don't think it was good. Ah. <laughs> I want that! Do you think you are the best talent in Titan? Yes. That was easy. Better not zap me though. <laughs> <laughs> we are all liars <laughs> here. <laughs> Alright, so I guess it works and we are all liars. So. Alright, so we have our first person, hi. Shannon. <laughs> Tell us a bit about yourself, Shannon. So hi, I'm Shannon. I I have been with Trev Monkey for a while mm, yes. and then after that Trev Monkey went under you guys and then right. now I'm kind of So you're yeah, kind of already in Titan. Yes. But we're still gonna ask you some questions <laughs> yeah. anyway. So Trev and Leonard are the two directors in Trev Monkey, right? Yeah. So who is the better boss? The better boss? Yeah, the better boss. I think... No thinking. Just gut feelings, girl. I'll go with Leonard. Oh, because... Because okay. Trev's not a good boss? No! <laughs> <laughs> because, okay, so Leonard does all the the production work. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Well, let's see. Let's see if, 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 if you're lying. Oh, I felt a bit off. No, you, you will know. You will know. <laughs> Trust us. I can't believe it. Wow! <laughs> That's all, Shannon. You have survived. Alright, so next up we have Clary, who is one of our newer talents that joined last year, but she's also a former Navy girl, so we have a few questions to ask. Hi. Hi, Clary. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nervous. I don't know why. <laughs> Tell us a little oh, no. about yourself. Oh, yeah. um, so, I think I'm one of the oldest, but I'm still very new to Titan. Like, I'm 28 this year, mm -hmm. but I joined last year. Right. Already? Yeah, already. <laughs> Please strap yourself in. Okay, the first question. Did you like the attention you got from the guys when you were at the Navy? Oh! So tough. Only yes or no, right? No yeah. in between, right? You can say and explain your answer. Yeah. I would say no. Yeah. Oh. No, because um, it was too overwhelming and it wasn't the reason why I joined the military. Mm -hmm. But yes, because it's where it got me to where I am today and how I I got into Titan. I think I'll go with a uh, yes, yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> so yes, you like the attention you got from guys when you were in the Navy. Okay, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Just to put it out there, that's the question. <laughs> right? Just to confirm. <laughs> I am so happy for you. I'm so proud of you. Yes, right. good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Excellent. Hey. Thank you, Clary. How oh, did we not get one? Yeah. Yeah. We didn't we get one. So yeah, not all of us got like, the thing. I, I, don't don't believe. I don't believe I have to lie through everything. Okay, so if you are gonna have more kids after this, okay. do you think you can love them equally? Or will Starly always be your favourite? My answer is I don't think that I can love someone more than her until I see them. Basically, I can't imagine me loving some other baby. But maybe I don't know. Ah! What? <laughs> what? So next up, we have Liz. She's also been part of Titan for quite a while now. Mm -hmm. She's under Cray 8, which is Ridwan's channel. So, hi Liz. Hi. Please take a step forward. 
Are you nervous? Are you okay? I think I'm very cold. You're cold? I'm very, very cold. So it makes you nervous? <laughs> yes, I think so, yeah. Alright. I'm Liz, I'm going 25, and I started, uh, I joined Titan Club of Create, then I joined, uh, then I was in Trust Monkey's video, and now I'm in Dan Hong's video as well. <laughs> Denise is so quiet. I'm so stressed. She is not ready for it. She is not ready for what's about to happen. If you had to pick one video, which is the video that you hated being part of the most? Hated being part of the most. You didn't like the script, the character that you were given, the role you were asked to play. Oh, okay, okay. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I spill the one, tea, I sis. So there was one video that we don't ask me to do a parody of, which is Senorita. Okay. It's super hard for me. I hated every second of it, but it turned out pretty well in the end. But during the filming, I really hated it. Why? Because mm. it's so uncomfortable. Like, I have to lip sync. It's just so weird for me. Okay. Yeah, it's really, really weird. Lip syncing is weird for me. Lip, lip for syncing? Me. You're not comfortable with lip no, syncing? No, I'm not. It's very, very strange. I think I'll be uncomfortable with it. Oh, but you have done it. I've done it. I've done it in the past. Oh! oh. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Come on. You can have the contract. Thank you. You already have the contract. Yeah, you already have the contract. Okay. Next up, we have a special talent because not only is he a talent, well, he's not a talent yet, mm -hmm. he is an intern of Titan Digital Media. Please take a step forward, Rainer. Hello, hello. Hi, Rainer. Hello, guys. Hello, Seho. Uh, okay, so I've been in Titan for almost eight months. Uh, I'm under production, so I mostly do NGG gaming videos. Just want to let you know uh -huh. that we didn't write this project. <laughs> Are you attracted to anyone in the new cast? Don't lie. If you, if you don't li if you if you lie, you're not gonna get this, man. Yeah, I, I think there are a few cast members that are pretty and handsome. Yeah, like yeah. Like, oh, handsome. Like, will you talk? Who will you talk to in the new yeah. class? We're uh, talking Grace, Crystal Bell, Farah, Bella. Bella. Nope. No. I, I, so you're I'm not, not attracted to Bella? Disappointment. Oh, Disappointment. Okay, okay. Uh, Crystal Bell and Bella. Uh, I think they're very nice people. You didn't have to say two, but okay. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I see you. Hey, Bella, he'll text you, man. Get it wrong, get it wrong. I. Yeah, Oh I'm so proud of you. Thank you, thank you. I'm happy. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Next up, we have Bella. You can't miss her. She has really outstanding hair. Her fashion sense is immaculate. And basically, she just stands up. Hey, guys. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Are you nervous? Uh, yes, I am. You better be. Oh, you get Z three times. So Your first question, question, who would you hook up with in Titan? <laughs> you have to name a person, you can't say nobody. Be honest. It doesn't matter if the person is attached or single, just like based on looks. Vincent? Probably because I've known him the longest. Vincent? Ah! <laughs> 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 also, I guess it's not Vincent. Who is it? Who is it? Because I don't really want to hook up anyone. Alright. Oh, that's good. Yes. That's cool. Is that all? My hand's shaking. Yeah, you got job, mantra, good job, good job. but good job. <laughs> yeah, alright. Next up, we have uh, Te Tung. Hi. 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 Let's take a seat. Hi. Nice to meet all of you. Why is your voice suddenly yeah. so low? Hi. Okay. <laughs> okay. How, how, old, how old are you? Oh, I'm 28 years old. Okay. Um, my hobbies include acting, singing, hosting, playing piano, and going to the gym. Nice. Hi. Do you think you are the best actor in the new cast? Best actor in the new cast? Um, among all of them, do you think you are the best actor? Um, you can be truthful. You can be truthful. <laughs> no Even if you lie, yeah, it's a yes or no question. So we'll know how you really think. Oh my god, I don't offend the rest of them. Uh, okay. I mean, I, I don't know. If you lie, it will, it will shock yeah. you. So we will know that yeah. you're lying. You might as well be truthful. Uh, okay, yes. Alright, yes. 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 So he thinks he's the Finally. best actor. He right? thinks he's the best. Look at this guy. Confident. Confident. Thinking he's the best. Ah! 
is Kelly. I'm still in Facebook. Good job. Welcome, hey, welcome to Titan. Welcome to Titan. <laughs> Alright, next up we have Elijah and he is a fitness instructor mm -hmm. and also he teaches boxing and spinning. Alright. Hi. 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 Can you tell us a bit about yourself? Okay, uh, I'm Elijah. So for me, I teach over at Blue Box and Blue Cycle. I teach in Spin and boxing. Alright, now put your hand in. <sighs> Do it extra tight. He's a spin instructor. Yeah, he's a spin instructor. Yeah, yeah. He's alright. <laughs> Which girl do you find most attractive in the new cast? I don't really know them well enough. No, mate. It's okay. Yeah. It's all about the physically, looks. physically attractive. attractive. Oh, sure, just like. Um, um, Diana. Oh. Aww. All right. So just say it again. Diana is the most attractive girl in the new yeah, cast. Yeah, in the new cast. No, in the whole sentence. Diana Baka is the most attractive girl in the new cast. Yeah, I just make it. Oh, 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 good job! Good job! Amazing, amazing. Nice, I nice. Nice. Oh. Alright, good job. Welcome right. to Titan. Thank, thank, you, thank, you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you. Alright, so next up we have Diana. So she's also a part of Create 8. She's actually the OG talent of Create 8. Take a seat. Hey guys. Diana, would you like to tell us a bit about yourself? I am 24 this year. Um, I've been with Titan for a few years now. I am in the new series, so I'm excited. Alright. Alright. Good intro. Please put your hands in. So you've been in a lot of uh, Trev Monkey shoots recently. Would you rather be a talent under Trev Monkey's channel? Um, no. So you'd rather be a creative? Yeah, because I believe in people who spot me when I was nothing. So I will always be with them till like the end unless I see like there's no point in helping them. I, I really hope. I'm, That's I'm, a very I'm good answer. For, yeah, very good answer. Yeah. Accept it. I hope I hope it's a true. But you need to put your hands down, sis. Okay. Yeah. So I guess that more, right? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Congratulations. Good. You did well. Yeah. I'm, happy for you. I'm happy for you. I'm scared I get that for like nothing. Great. Second question. Do you think Red One is handsome? No. Oh. <laughs> <That was> <laughs> <laughs> no hesitation. No, fans, <laughs> just, no. no hesitation, just answer. <laughs> Good answer. <laughs> Can you just say it again? You just say, I don't think. I don't think you're right, Sansa. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alright, we got that. I agree. <laughs> Good job, Diana! Next up, we have another intern mm -hmm. who is also now a talent. If he gets the contract. His name is Tongan. He is the producer for this freaking episode. So he wrote the questions for himself. Yep. And we Which have we conveniently changed. It. changed it. We have changed, we have changed it. it. So, Hi Tongan. Hi, Hi Tongan. Tell us about yourself. Uh, I'm the producer for Team Titan. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I've worked here for like six months. As wow. an intern. Yeah. yeah, as an intern, then I changed into a full timer. Wow, and you got a big role. Uh, In fact, today is his second day officially as a full timer. Congratulations on your conversion. And uh, please get yourself strapped in. <laughs> and uh, make it tight. Yeah, push it down. Yeah. Push down All the down. way. Maybe more interesting if I put it in water. How about you put your hand in the socket? So the question is, do you think you are a better employee than Daniel Ron? No. You don't think that no, you're No, there's no way. Wait, we'll see. Wait, we'll see about that. Wow! Good job. Well done, well done. Good job. Well done. Amazing well work. Done. I'm so proud of you. Thank I'm you so you. proud of you. I'm so proud of you. I was rooting for yeah, you. You are a great, <laughs> humble man. Yes. Good job. Good job. Alright, keep on the good work. Good job. Edit Thanks. this video later. Next up, we have Grace and Grace is very fashionable. You can check out her Instagram feed. She has super pretty pictures. And one very interesting fact about her is that she loves pictures. Hi, take a seat. Hi, She's Grace. so nervous. Are you nervous? I don't want to get that. Okay, then Too you bad. better tell the truth. <laughs> Hi, some fun I'm facts. Grace. And I'm very scared of pain, actually. Who would you hook up with in Titan? I get like the definition of like hook up. <sighs> Goodness, all you definition people. So, who would you hook yeah. up with? Honestly, there are a lot of... A lot of people. <laughs> no, a lot of people. A lot of people. I cannot know. <laughs> wow. <laughs> like, I cannot remember everybody. I can't even know. Ra That's why, man. Razin. Razin? Really? We have Hakim. We have... Oh my god. Um, Daniel Ron. 
Yeah. We have read one. <laughs> if he's in the option list, he's not in mine. He's not in mine too. <laughs> Uh, this is like just a shading <laughs> video. Can I choose the Chong? You you hook up with the Chong. <laughs> because the Chong is like so like happy and everything, so it wouldn't be awkward after. Like really? You don't think he's just acting through it? He has ten years of acting experience. Ten years, right? No, but he's so happy and friendly and like cute and like <laughs> you know? <laughs> like so it wouldn't be awkward because I don't want it to be awkward afterwards. Also it's like a one time thing. You wouldn't have oh, it like no, of like course one, we won't go two times. times. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so the song is a one time kind uh, of time. Everybody would be a one time. <laughs> no thank you again. Uh, yeah, okay. okay. I'm All not right. about that. Okay, accepted. He's one time thing. But okay. I'm gonna just say not. <laughs> Alright, like right, good job, Grace. Next up we have Farah mm -hmm. and she recently joined us like last week, so please. Hello. Welcome. Nice to see you. I'm probably the youngest in the Team Titan. Mm -hmm. I'm 17 this year. That's really young. Um, currently waiting for school in April. Okay. Do you think you are the most attractive person in the new cast? No. Now who's the most attractive person? Yeah, now who's the most attractive? New no, cast. New oh, cast. New oh, cast. Oh, she thinks she is the most attractive. But that's fine to nice. confidence. Yeah, fine. Yeah. No, but honestly, though, who do you think is most attractive? Mm. Mm. Alright. Okay. Cool. Okay. Good job. Thank you, Sarah. Great job. So next up, we have none other than my own family member, Zikai, who is my little cousin, who is nine years younger than me. Please take a seat. Alright, so why don't you tell us about yourself? I don't know, I just like... You're very tall. Yeah, tall. He's, uh, he's like What's your height? 180. Wow. wow. He's tall. And I've been watching Titan Girl since I was a very young, at a very young age. Yeah. Yes. 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 Ever yeah, since sure. the first few videos from the Tian Hao Tan. Jikai. It feels so fun and yes, it feels so cooling. It feels cooling? Yes. Alright, put your hands in. Question number one. Have you ever used being Tian Hao's cousin to benefit yourself? No. Never. I don't like doing these type of things to make myself feel good. No, but not make yourself feel good. Let's say you go... I don't like to take advantage of stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I accept it. I accept lock it. it. In? I lock it in. Let's All lock right. it in. <gasps> wow. Alright. Good, right. good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Yeah. Thank Welcome you, thank to you. Titan. Thank you. <laughs> so, the final one will be Christabel. Mm -hmm. So, I found her on TikTok. And from there, we invited her over and had a nice interview and Christabel is officially a part of Titan now. So please come forward as we ask you some questions. Hi! Hi! Hi. <laughs> Are you nervous? Uh, yes. Yeah. I'm Christabel and I'm 20 this year. Okay? Yeah, done. <laughs> I'm scared. What is your opinion of Dikosh? He reviewed your video. He yeah, reviewed yeah. your video. How did you feel about that? Do you hate him? I was so offended because I feel like we're all doing it for entertainment. Mm. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you're happy you got some clout from it? I don't even know if there is clout. Do you see any like increase in followers or comments or engagement in your oh, like TikTok? Like people following from yeah. like, oh you're the girl in yeah. Dikosh yeah, yeah, video. Yeah. Oh people say, that. people say that. There's a few, yeah. They will purposely go and find that same video mm -hmm. and uh -huh. they will comment. So what about your impression of him now? Following the whole incident? Everything that happened, like... I'm just cool about it. You're cool. Alright. All right. Accept it. Let's go. Can you talk to me? <laughs> <laughs> I keep thinking of that, that thing. Boom! Yeah, hey! Don't worry. It's, Don't it worry. doesn't hurt. <laughs> I, yeah, sure. <laughs> Can we play back when she said that it hurt? And we oh, are all liars, so... <laughs> <laughs> all right, good job, Christabel. Good job. Alright, so that's it. Obviously, this isn't a real thing, so don't take everything uh, that just happened so seriously, even though it was great fun. Yeah. And yeah, welcome all the new talents to Titan. I'm sure that's going to be very exciting. Do you have a word of advice for them? I think that seeing all of them today, they have a lot of potential. And like some of them have really nice Instagram feeds, so I would really recommend you guys to go and check them out, go and follow them, and you know, be supportive for their new series that's going to come out, because it will be very interesting. And some of them are nice yeah. and talented. Some, I mean, some, they're all nice. some. <laughs> yeah. Only some. So show them your support. Yeah. For me, I think just 
just have fun. We have a lot of fun yeah. in our shoots. So yeah, yeah, I think that's the most important thing. If you don't have fun, it becomes kind of boring. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. feel like work. Every time it's just like you're coming to play yeah. with your friends. Except oh. for class wars. <laughs> oh, class wars. Class wars yeah. intense. So yeah, that's it. Go watch the uh, new series and click here to subscribe. And uh, click here to watch. Yep. All right. we'll Thank you. you. Bye, bye bye. Thank you. Three thousand dollars. Thousand dollars. $3,000, $3,000, $3,000, $3,000. If you're not able to spend it within the hour, you have to return it all to me. Make it rain, guys. <laughs> all right, guys, so this is really happening. I have a little bit of cash with me, $25,000. And because it's the festive season, Santa Howe is in the mood of giving. The Titan team has worked so hard throughout the whole year and I think it's time for us to play a little game. Now, I am going to be giving everyone this money. But here's the thing, they have only one hour to spend it and if they don't spend it within the hour, they will have to return it all to me. Now, they are all in the Titan Auditorium. They're not sure of what's going on. They think that we are going to be giving out some awards. So let's do that first. It's been such a great year at Titan. Such a great year with everyone here. It's been the craziest year for me, for Debbie, for everyone here. We started with the proposal, finding out the baby, the wedding, the gender review. So I'm really happy that all of you guys were able to be with us throughout this journey to achieve these milestones with Debbie and I. Within the company as well, that we have achieved such great things. Everyone has been doing such an amazing job. Basically, I have nothing bad to say about everyone. So every Everyone here is really important to the company and I'm really glad that you guys are here. Yeah. So today we are going to be giving out some Titan Awards for the very first time. Can everyone split yourself into six groups? We are going to do a challenge. Because it's the festive season, Santa How is in the mood of giving. Okay, uh, one person from each group, $3,000. Echo. Hakim, then. $3,000 $1,000 $2,000 Every group has $3,000, right? Here's the thing You guys have only one hour to spend this And if you're not able to spend it within the hour You have to return it all to me Now you have one hour So make it rain, guys! <laughs> The boss of Titan have actually given us a lump sum of money and we are given the choice to spend in an hour. Dude, she does, does so much eh. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I don't want to spend on it. So today our boss has given us all the money to spend! Oh my god, guys, let's go, let's go, let's go! It's only 3,000 and we need like Gucci and equipment. Then don't go to Gucci. Okay, why, why, why not LV? How about LV? Well, I guess you need more for LV. Yeah, you can have a thousand more. Eh, thanks bro. Shit. Okay, bro, so we did. <laughs> Basically, right? You give each team 3k, okay. correct? Oh, yeah. But we actually got an extra 1k. Keep it, keep it. Keep it. Oh! Now we have $3,000 to splurge yes. on expensive clothes. So we are gonna do just that. Um, so we are. Uh, what are we gonna get again? Oh, then let's go now, then let's go. We now. have to go. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Vincent, stop eating. Let's go, let's go. So now, hey guys, faster, 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 faster. Hey, don't run, don't run! Oh hey, don't run! We're the last group to go. And you have not a lot of time. Let's, girls, faster, all your fault lah, all your fault, let's go. Okay guys, guys, let's just book Grab Premium because, you know, today we ballin'. We're waiting for our Grab, it's about four minutes right now. Okay, our Grab is here, bye! Okay! Hey, we're going, let's go! 
Okay, so Vincent, where are we going now? We are heading to Mandarin Orchard because all kind of likes babes, and I, I like babe. You guys like babe too, I right? Love babe. So, I love I haven't owned a babe because like I've always feel like I didn't have the amount of money to spend on it, but now I do. How about you do? You got babe? I no one cares. <laughs> okay, okay, well, why not we try uh, googling how to spend money? All four of us have already agreed where we want to go, right, City? Yes! City is our driver for today. Thank you. Warm driver. And <laughs> we have to spend $3,000 in one hour. First things first, yes, of course we need to get a mic for this camera. And then, we can buy more equipment. Let's split the money now. This bag is worth a lot right now. Oh, stop, 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 stop. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, let's go, let's go. Alright, let's go. Yeah, yes. 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 Thank you so much, man. We are here at a go shop. We could, if I, uh, I want two things if I can. Actually, yes. Eliza and I's first time in a go shop. Yeah. We're gonna go and find something for the oh, giveaway really? for you guys. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go! So we're paying for the mic now. Okay, so after walking for a while, I believe we have found the perfect giveaway yeah. for our male viewer, which is. We found ladies first, one of the ladies first guys And there's another ladies first guy So I'm guessing they're buying airpods Yeah, that was my oh, plan dude. because I'm a ladies first class too okay, So right now we are at Babe at Mandarin Orchard And uh, we bumped into we got inside So I think we're gonna change our plans and go to the villa instead Let's hope we find something So we just got our mics And right now we are gonna put on a mic And you will hear a drastic audio improvement So let's go only 499 so, I think 499 499 499 okay, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. so right now we're at Archer Road trying to decide where to shop where are we going we're going Nike <laughs> we obviously don't know where to go but we definitely have much money to spend we're going to a Nike to get some gift cards for you guys because we love you and you guys always support us so buy something for you all we're gonna get a mic first okay we're gonna get first first of the equipment list we need a mic yes we need, we need a, a microphone, microphone. Let's, 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 let's get it. Okay, okay let's get it, let's get it. Come on, let's get it, man. Alright. Yes, no, my yeah. money, yes, man. Yeah, 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 really? yeah, let's go. <laughs> we were looking around the store and then we saw that they have these the really cute, iconic Kate Spade bags. Maybe we should get one. Okay, show it, show it to them. Yeah, let's go. 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 let us go this, this one is for you. Okay. okay. I saw chop one. No, I'm trying to look at the... The chart, no GST, you save more. Ooh, one by five. No okay. one. First purchase of the day. Alright, so we just bought the AirPods. $128 and we have around $522 left. Downstairs, I don't buy a dog much. Bye, Rob. Bye-bye. Let me just, me just, me, what is it? What is it? I'm not happy. Can you buy iPad? We got no time! We got no time! We got the fuse. I'm playing a bit of iPad Air and an iPad Pencil. Ooh. We're gonna rush over to Sephora. Yeah, maybe a lipstick, some sort of makeup palette. Ooh, all the Christmas sets are out! We are really lagging behind in time. We are rushing. I'm sweating. It's gonna be amazing to some bars, yo. Alright, so we got Echo on the phone over here. I don't know who he's talking to, but he's whispering. Came up with like uh, Hakim's team, so you know, our team has 3k. Uh -huh. And if both teams team up together, we have 6k. We are going to get something exciting for okay. the company. Alright, so... let's do this. Jude, stop getting distracted! Go, 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 quickly! Okay, so I'm looking for a shirt now. We have so much of budget, we $600 each. So like, we're going to get a shirt or so. I don't know what else to get. I'm so lost. Like, well, help me. <laughs> Yeah, that's your pick. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. So go see other stores. Yes, get away from everyone though. You got it. You got iPad. Yes. So I'm alone in the auditorium now, as you guys can see, and I'm just waiting for the crew to return. And I'm very nervous to find out what they did with the money and how they spent it. Uh, not gonna lie, you know, this time alone has made me realize what I just did, which is giving away 2,000, 20, 23, I don't know. I don't know. I gave away a lot. 
I, I see the pitch. Some of you may point out that, you know, uh, Mr. Beast did this concept. So yeah, this concept is very inspired by Mr. Beast. Sure. And you know what? I think it's a cool way to, um, my way of rewarding um, my crew. You know, they've done such an amazing job this year with everything. And they stuck with me through thick and thin, through the baby, finding out about the baby and then the proposal and then helping me plan the wedding and then the baby actually came out, finally came out. Of course, she came out. And anyway, it's been so crazy. And aside from all of this, the team has also hit such amazing milestones with um, the company. So yeah, I'm really proud of them. And uh, will I do this again? I don't, I uh, know. No, I won't. <laughs> no. So yeah, I'm just waiting for the crew to return and we'll see what they got. It's real, like time is running. And then, and then we're still not done yet. And then later I have to drive like an F1 driver back to office like I'm not gonna give up this money yo I'm gonna wear it now This is <gasps> Okay okay you wanna hurry man You don't have gold member then you can like skip the queue Gold membership No It's stressful man Spending money is stressful kids Don't spend money Gucci necklace It's not very practical but It's fine I feel good the most important thing is that you must feel good, so yeah. Come on, I go, come on, I go, press the button. Okay, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, alright, alright. Cannot make up our mind, there's too much money, too little time. Yeah. It cannot give us like one day, maybe like, you know, we can like have the time to think. Yeah. Like, one hour. Yeah, but one we got one hour, hour, we got a rush. Eight, one hour. Eight, there are 250 only. Yeah. We need to spend bigger, guys. Alright, okay, 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 let's go. Jing jing. Nope, that's not the only receipt. One, two, three, four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, 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 eight. Let me call Vincent to check it. Like, to check what's the status. No, we are not done yet. Wait, you guys are not done. Wait, guys. We are still at. We are still at Ion. Ion, we are, Paragon. we are going to Paragon. So, this is Echo from the other team. Hello. And we have decided that we are going to combine our money. Yeah. Alright, let's go. I need to pull over and I cannot find one proper one like that so Remind me, never to go shopping with Julie. <laughs> she, is so in, she is so indecisive. Spending that, that last few dollars is the irritating thing if we have to return back everything because of two dollars. I'm going to flip on them. I have one dollar. Shit, girl, you... Oh, we just bought a watch. Um, mm, yeah. <laughs> I think we've like 30 minutes there so we really need to hurry up. <laughs> this is the lens that we are getting. How much is it? Uh, 3099. Oh. Okay, uh. Oh. Oh. No, it's okay, it's fine. It's fine. 830. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we are heading back to the office now and we no. have like, what, 5 minutes? So let's go! <laughs> Two thousand. Okay, we're gonna 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 Okay, we're I, I think right now we're like the last group. I, I hope we're not. So let's hurry up guys. Joan, have you booked the grip? I am the burden of the group. Every group has a burden. <laughs> <laughs> I be the tribute. Okay, so guys, we're not the last. We're not the last! We're not the last! So we are not here. We brought a lot of things. It might look like we don't have anything on our hands, but we got something very valuable and all of us had the same thinking. Okay, all of us got gold. We got gold bracelets. She had gold earrings, gold ring, gold bracelet, gold ring, gold ring. I got a bracelet and I also got a gold bar. <laughs> and you? Bracelet plus a pendant. pendant. Yes. Wow. And after that, we still had money left. So we had bubble tea for everyone. After that, we still had money left. <laughs> so we got so so bar. Very good. Thank you, Tianhao. Well done, well done. So first things first, what we bought was uh, nice three jackets that like, make us look like Powerpuff Girls. <laughs> then we bought something for Starly. Aww. We bought everyone chocolates. Aww, that's nice. And we wrote everyone cards, personalised cards. You wrote cards? Handwriting, uh, it's very important, you know, so it's like, a, you know, from the heart. 
$100 Nike gift cards for all yeah. viewers. Okay. 10 $100 gift cards. Yeah. How generous. Yeah, for the fans. Well done, well done. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, so uh, for myself, I got a big jacket. Uh, I really like the fit of it. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think it looks pretty sick, you know. When you when you're shopping, you need to make yourself feel good. That's why I, I think about this. Of course, you know it has it's a Gucci. Yeah, it has a lot of meaning. It's a tea. <laughs> it's a tea. <laughs> so you know the tea is uh, means a lot to me because uh, it's it's it stands for Trev Monkey. So yeah, that's right. You know, yeah. <laughs> so one lucky fan will walk away with one, this. One. This t-shirt, Singapore at the back. That's right. That's limited edition, guys. For myself, I got a, I got an iPad. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That's right. I got an iPad. That's right. And then with the iPad, I got a Apple pencil. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Yes, we need that for work. We need this for work, yes. We got a babe singlet as well. Okay, we'll start with the thank yous. We got a really nice filler bag right here. That is nice. We need dual purpose, okay? You guys got Swarovski for the fans. We got Swarovski for the fans, okay? It's a very cute bracelet. Vincent, please hold it. Just one. Oh, just open. Okay, we've said enough. The rest is. Okay, the rest is filler, that's about it. You don't have to know what it is, it's just filler. Everything's filler, nothing else. 25 yes, items. items. Yeah, we bought 25 items. So for each male and female, we'll give them an... Uh, it's not the newest airport because the newest one ran out for... We also bought a Casio watch, which cost like 230. So yeah. for the... And for the girls, they will get um, a Kate Spade bag. We decided to have two prizes, one for a girl and one for a guy, because you know in the past few months, as this first has grown, a lot more boys have started watching also, so we don't want to forget about them and just buy like makeup and stuff. Okay, last but not least, production crew. So these two teams combined halfway. Oh yes, let's let's start with the giveaway first. Okay, we got a bunch of mouse that we're gonna give away from Razer. One's from Razer, and then the rest are Logitech. Uh, but yeah, these are all for the fans. We're giving away mouse. Nice. Yes. Good yes. job. Okay. This is gaming mouse. Production team. For the production team, uh, we got a shirt from JD Sport. We got a. Nike shirt, and the reason why it's white is because uh, we want everyone to sign it to the fan to give it away. Just got this Peak Design runner bag, so yeah, you know, inside you can store a lot of lenses, so yeah, it's like upgraded uh, okay, runner bag. So, awesome. yeah, so uh, we got ourselves a brand new Manfrotto monopod wow. for production as well. Yeah. We got two MC11s. Uh, this lens is the 7200 G Master, <laughs> so. Um, <laughs> this is the reason why me and Echo, like, you know, like the team, we just yeah, our team combined, because this costs more than what any single team can afford. Because Jenna, he has been saying that he wanted this lens for so long, so we spent exactly the amount. Exactly. So you didn't have to top up a bit. Exactly on the dot. Exactly on the dot. Plus grab rights also. Okay, grab awesome, rights. great job. Thank you. All right. Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the very first episode of. Class Wars, this is a brand new segment and today we have the boys and girls of Class T1, T5 going head to head together in a game of brains. And the winning team will get a thousand dollars. Oh my god! Like real money? Just yeah, to show you guys, it's real. It's real, it's real, okay, okay. So let's meet the teams. Alright, today so we have the girls team and the boys team. Let's meet the ladies first. I'm Jasmine. I'm Debbie. I'm Sherilyn. I'm Denise. Abby. Vicky. <laughs> and Juhi. Woo! Yay! <laughs> Alright, let's give it up for the girls team. Alright, there's a beautiful blend of beauty and brains over in this team. And let's meet brains. the macho man of class T1, T5. Who do we have here? I am gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm Tian Hao as well. I'm Ben. I'm Rony Siang. <laughs> Why? I'm, why I'm, the boys? <laughs> why the boys? I'm Vincent, and we pretty much won the first, uh, the first segment already. Uh, the what? what? I'm sure. <laughs> Look at the win, win, man. You may not sound like losers, you know. Yeah, damn it. Yeah. You just dropped the move. Don't say that, man. <laughs> you make us sound. You make us sound bad. Today we are going to have 
four different sections. Just like your exam papers, each section will be in A, B, C, and D. And section A, we're going to have a general knowledge quiz, all right? Each team will have 90 seconds to answer 20 questions in a quick fire round. So before we begin, let's see how our contestants are doing. Girls, do you guys have any plans? Denise, you look very, very troubled. I'm super stressed. I cannot perform well under stress. And this is the only exam she has never prepared for in her life. <laughs> no, actually, I prepared. Like, oh, you did? <laughs> 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 she honestly, 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 like, look at this. Like, she's not even supposed to have this right now. Put it, put it away. So last night, I was reading up on trivia. I was reading wow. up on pop culture. <laughs> what? Well, coming for someone who has actually a double degree, it's... It's really no surprise right there. Denise, yes. you guys are pretty confident, so what's your plan? What's the game plan here? Winning. Winning. What, what is the plan, guys? Winning. Is the plan? Winning is our plan. That's the plan. <laughs> I don't think we came into this with a plan. None of us prepared. <laughs> I, I know, I didn't prepare. I didn't prepare. However, I think, uh, who do you think is their weak link? Generally, Denise. <laughs> Over preparation is the worst thing you can ever do. So Denise, you should be nervous. Oh. Oh. Mind games, oh. wow. <laughs> What do you think, Vincent? Hey, it's Sherilyn. It's Why Sherilyn? Because Sherilyn's just gonna be like, ah, ah guys, I, I don't know eh. You, you, you know or not? <laughs> David, do you know the answer? Oh ah, my god, that does sound like Sherilyn. <laughs> but actually, Sherilyn is like, she's pretty good at school, yeah. right? She's in the Dean's list. Sorry? The Dean's list? You are in the what list? It doesn't matter what. <laughs> 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 Alright girls, so the boys have a lot of things to say to you, right? There's a lot of bent on the guy's side. So who do you think is their weakest link? Red one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He talks too much. Yeah. <laughs> He's too cocky. I have to agree with them. Uh, actually, I, 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 do, I do agree with them. Whoa. So yeah, you'll need it. So yeah. Yeah. Good luck, you'll need it boys. Alright. Okay. Alright. So this is a team quiz. So boys, we'll let the ladies go first, yeah? Okay? Yes. Yeah, yes. Why? Sure. Because ladies first, but ladies. guys were last. What? what? We'll last long, last long. Okay. Right, we will survive. Oh my god, just shut up. Let's just shut up. <laughs> you guys, can we just put... <laughs> Alright. Ben, right. ben seems awfully quiet. Yeah. 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 Ben seems awfully is, is quiet. Is Ben your like, secret weapon? What's going through your mind right now, Ben? Uh, I'm totally unprepared. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Hey. So you'll have 90 seconds to answer as many questions as you can, alright? You guys have to discuss amongst yourself and one person will have to shout out the answer towards me. Denise, you have to listen to me, alright? I'm listening. You're listening? Alright, cool, cool. Just to make sure, right? <laughs> if you don't know the answer to the question, you can choose to skip. What's the topic about? It's general knowledge, right? So this question can be about anything and everything. Timekeeper, are we ready? Are you ready, girls? Your time starts now. Who is Han Solo's son? Skip. What is the famous weapon used by Jedi Knights in the Star Wars series? Lightsaber. 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 Who painted the Mona Lisa? Leonardo. What she said. <laughs> Leonardo da Vinci. How long does an eyelash live before it falls out? One. Two weeks. One. Two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks. Skip. One. Skip. Cruella de Vil is the villain in which Disney movie? 101 Dalmatians. Peter Parker works as a photographer for what company? Skip. 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 Alright, skip. What is the only mammal that can truly fly? 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 Oh, <laughs> fly. <laughs> For the fashion label DKNY, the initials stand for what? Donna Karen New York. <laughs> what is the third sign of the zodiac? Zodiac, like Chinese zodiac. Horoscope. Tiger, tiger. Horoscope, sorry. Haiku. Wrong. Aquarius. Shall we skip? Deal, deal. No, Aquarius. Wrong. Wrong. Gemini. Gemini. Yes. Alright, and your time is up! And the girls have a total of 5 marks. Alright, out of 20 questions. Well, the boys, you can tell they were so excited the moment I said out the first question. Guys, can you please explain to the girls 
who is Han Solo son. Ben Solo. Yeah. Ben. AKA Ridwan. <laughs> Kylo Ren. Kylo Ren. That's right. That's right. Peter Parker works for Daily Bugle. <laughs> what is the mammal that? What is the mammal that flew? Uh, it's a bat. <laughs> when Tiahal did this, the only thing that I thought of was like a will. <laughs> it worked! It worked! Alright girls, so how do you feel after your first round? It's just, you know... It's just a warm Oh, they better yeah, get some makeup questions, man. Yeah, yeah! We got like none of like the Easy, general... Man. I think, right, to save time, one person decides to skip and that person should be me. Because if everyone requires time to skip, then I think it will take about 3 to 5 seconds. So we need more questions, more answers, and then we will win. All right, all right. So if I decide to skip, we will skip, okay? All right, all right. let's do it, man. All right, see, the boys came with a plan. Very practical. 90 seconds on the clock starts now. What is another name for Supergirl? Who was the first Disney princess based on a real historical figure? C Cinderella. Cinderella! Wrong. Snow White! Snow White! Snow White. Snow White. Pocahontas! Pocahontas! Yes. What is the profession of Mario and his brother Luigi? Plumbers! Plumbers! Plumbers. Plumbers. How did Spider-Man get his superpowers? Spider-Man! 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 Spider Spider by him! What Spider-Man? Radioactive! Radioactive! Radio Radio what is the name of the city that Supergirl protects? Supergirl! Skip, skip, skip! How often should you replace your mascaras? Uh, one month. Two months. Three months. Half a year. One, one, one year. Two weeks. Skip! Skip. Which fashion brand made the genius jeans that became part of the Guinness World Record? Uh, Levi's. 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 Wrong. Gucci. Gucci. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, 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 mango, mango, and fashion. Oh, Forever 21. Skip, 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 skip. Skip. You guys have to choose on one answer, okay? Adults have 32 teeth. How many teeth do kids have? 42. 32? 47? 32. 16. 32. 12. 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Skip, you, skip, you guys skip. can't just skip. Choose the message. 12. What is Superman's only weakness? What color is Mary Jane Watson's hair? Hair! Red, 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 red! red. <laughs> How many dots are there on a six-sided dice? Six! <laughs> uh, 40, 40, 40. 12! 21! 21. What is the name of Princess Jasmine's tiger? Simba! Simba. I know this, I know this, I know this! I know this. <laughs> Raj, Raj, Raja! Raja. Raja. And your time is up! I'm so sorry, Ridwan. Your time was up. Alright, boys, your only mistake was not choosing one answer. Someone might have said the correct answer, but no one came to a conclusion. But we got the right answer. But yeah. you guys didn't choose together. It's a team, it's a team oh. work. <laughs> this is not cool, man. Yeah, this is not cool. Cool, We're man. on the back team. Back team, how, how many did we get? I believe we got six, right? The, the, the G's question, they got correct Gucci. But only Kevin answered. Who said Gucci? Nice no, oh, no, 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 Gucci! Gucci! I yeah, got it right. Months. Three months. How yeah. many points? But they got so many superhero questions that we could. Like, oh come yeah. on, Supergirl. If I Who is Marvel? Supergirl? Yeah. You watch a Supergirl, yeah. man. Yeah. Come on, ask like Captain Marvel or Wonder Woman. Supergirl. Like, Supergirl Super don't even yeah. have a yeah. movie. So guys, at the end of section A, the girls currently stand with five points, and the guys have a total of eight points. Yes. Ah. All right, girls. So after the first round of section A, how do you guys feel? Now we have a better. We learn from our mistakes. Yeah. Now we know the rules better. Right. We're more psyched. Yes, we can do it! Alright, alright. Judy, you're very quiet over there with your dance moves. Any, <laughs> any, anything, anything to add? <laughs> yeah, that's what's distracting, guys. Actually, I, I'm just very distracting. Oh, so you're the distractor. Oh, okay. Wow, they have a distractor. Oh, it's so distracting. Very good. <laughs> alright, boys, so after the first round, how do you guys feel? I think we crushed it. Yeah. I think we crushed yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, we had it and I think uh, I'm excited for the next round. Let's right. go. So this time, they'll be going up another round of quick fire, but you only have 60 seconds. And as long as someone shouts out the right answer and I hear it, we'll count that mark, alright? So girls, do not worry, we'll let the boys go first, alright? This time? Oh, oh. 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 Whoa. Right, we just guys. changed things up! Ah. Damn, not prepared, man. Alright, All right, 60 seconds on the clock <coughs> okay. starts. Now, what do you call a group of lions? A pride. Lion. A pride. Oh. Which Disney princess movie takes place in the USA? Cinderella. Cinderella. Wrong. Uh, uh, I know this, I know this. Uh, princess and the Frog. Princess and the Frog. How many legs does a spider have? Eight. 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 How many legs does a lobster have? Two. Eight, seven. Two. Six. Oh, wait more, wait more. Six, 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 six
Six. Six. Nine. Wrong. Ten. 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 What? <laughs> what is the largest <laughs> organ in a human body? Intestine, the big and skin. 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 What material is Black Panther suit made out of? Uh, vibranium. Vibranium. What country does the Black Panther rule? Wakanda! 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 What is Yoda's last name? Who? You may be served. Wait, are you... Master. <laughs> Master. Master. You are the chosen one. Okay. May the boss be with you! Skip, skip, skip. What? You can't skip. That's your last uh, question. I love you. Uh, 3000. Sh Shifu, Shifu. Uh, Shifu. And time's up. Uh, uh, the, the, the answer is... He doesn't have one. Yeah. Oh my oh, gosh! That's Vince, what, that's what? What? You should have said it louder, I didn't hear it. You were doubting yourself, Vincent. Yeah, I said he doesn't have a last name. Oh, come on, you're the Star Wars geek. How can you not know that? I, it was a trick question. This is <laughs> what? Well, what? you got tricked. The Joker. The Joker got tricked. I All right. didn't know that we had trick questions. Uh, I was yeah, like, I was like, he doesn't have a last name. Why is he asking <laughs> Oh my god, I just realized. Okay, but how many <laughs> points did we get out of that? You guys got a total of later you'll find out. So girls, are you ready? Yeah. It's your time to catch up with the boys, all right? Yeah, all right. Ladies, are you ready? Yeah. 60 seconds on the clock starts. <laughs> now, in what year was Minecraft released? 2002. Skip. Wrong. Skip. Is... You can't skip. 2009, correct. <laughs> Who is Chewbacca's best friend? That robot. robot. C3PO. Wrong. <laughs> I don't know. Wrong. Uh, oh, the, 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 the Ewok thing. Wrong. <laughs> Wrong. 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 We can't skip. Chewbacca's golf right now. Alright, sure, you can skip, you can skip. What is a golf ball made out of? Steel. Wrong. 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 Skip. Alright. In what year was the PS4 released? <laughs> 2006, 97, 98, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 2013. 2003. I heard 2013. Okay, 2013. What is Undertaker's real name? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Skip. Skip. What was the first Singapore's MRT station? Wrong. Wrong. Topayo, correct. How many states does the USA have? 52. Wrong. 50. 50. Alright, they got the last question in just in the nick of time. Woo! To be fair, I think the girls' questions were actually very tough. Even I didn't yeah. know some answers to these. Thanks, Dad. Yeah. I didn't yeah. come up with the questions. <laughs> yeah, Omar, Spider has eight legs. We all yeah. know that. Yeah. Yeah. So, the boys got a total of 15 marks. They got seven correct answers in that round. And the girls got a total of nine marks. You guys only got four correct answers. So now, yeah. so what is a golf ball made out of? Just give us a thousand. It is uh, made out of rubber. Huh? Golf ball is made out of rubber. Are you sure? I am very sure because the answer is right here. All right, guys. So that's the end of section A, and now we will head into section B. Girls, I think you will definitely flourish in this section. All right. And right now, section B, we have mathematics. All right. This is a team-based game again, once again. So there are two bells in front of you. All right. So the first team that can find an answer gets to ring a bell. But if your answer is wrong, the other team has a chance to answer. Each correct answer is worth three marks. Hey, foul <laughs> So each team will only have one chance to answer it correctly, alright? Everyone, how are you feeling about maths? Boys? Um, I just want to say that we have Denise who is Denise, we have Sherilyn who is like GPA is like 4.0, and then we have Jasmine who is a math tutor. So, I think we're a bit uh, unbalanced right here. Uh, we have two dropouts. I mean, how many, how many of us dropped out of school? Uh, we have two dropouts. <laughs> we have two dropouts right here. Drop -ups. We have Brady Xiao and we have Ben who hasn't really said anything yet. <laughs> so, it's just me and Kevin. How about Trev? Oh, oh, oh yeah, Trev is actually molecular biology. I don't even know what that is. That's science though, that's science man. Oh yeah, damn it. Don't you do math in science? That's not math. Let's go for it. Alright girls, how are you feeling? Pretty confident about this one? Alright everyone, are you ready? Yes, Denise, do you have a question? I don't have confidence in myself. My mind is blank. I think I'm as useful as Ben right now. So are you... What? Alright, everyone ready? Everyone ready? Alright, bells are in place. 
let's carry on with Section B. If four students can do four exam papers in four hours, how many exam papers can eight students do in eight hours? We already have an answer and the boys haven't even written out anything. So Denise, what four. is your answer? Four. The answer is four? It's four. Four. One student can do one paper in, in four hours. So regardless of how many students you have or how many papers you have, you're still going to take four. Let me just say first, Denise, how confident are you with your answer? Oh, I'm not confident anymore. <laughs> 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 what was your final answer? Just say it. It's okay. Just... Oh my god, I don't know. Just say it. What was your answer? Four, four, four can do four papers. <laughs> 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 one student, one student can do <laughs> four papers. <laughs> okay, 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 I'm so sorry. Okay, oh, let, let, just, just tell me your answer. What was your answer? Four, eight. Eight? Is eight your final answer? The answer is wrong. I'm so sorry. Mm. Guys, you have a chance to redeem this point. What is your final answer? What so are you after, doing? After March calculation. Okay, they're wrong also. Why they're wrong also? No one, then, get, then no one, one gets, gets a point. point. Oh, okay. yeah. Wait, wait, wait. wait. I, I have to say that in this situation, right, I don't think that even I'm thinking straight. Like, I cannot even process the question in my head. So I'm, I'm just literally like, I just feel really intense right now and I don't know what this guy is drawing but if it's not 4, if it's not 8, then it is 16! Are you sure about your answer? <laughs> not really. <laughs> not really. But, but let's lock it down. Yeah. 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 But we have a better chance than them. All in is 16! Yes. Are you sure about that? Yeah. Yeah. Girls, yeah. do you think the guys are right with 16? I think it's 16. 16. Yeah. The answer is 16. Yeah! yeah. Because each student takes four hours to complete one paper. So eight divided by four, you get two. And you got eight students point. with two papers, <laughs> you get 16. All right, boys and girls, on to the next question. Alvin, Theodore, and Simon, aka the chipmunks, shared a tin of cookies. Alvin took two thirds of the tins of cookies and five cookies. Huh? Theodore took two thirds of the remaining tin of cookies and five cookies. Simon only received two cookies. How many cookies did Alvin have? <laughs> Just so that you guys know, this is a primary four question. So well, I got a primary three math level up. So have an answer already? You guys have to choose an answer. What is your final answer? Is that your final answer? 57? Yes. The answer is correct. 57 oh, cookies in total. That, that is fast. crazy. That's fast. That's fast. That is I'm crazy. Yeah. It's too fast. You guys are, what are you? The machines. Well, wow. you, you're going up against someone who has a GPA of 4.0, a yeah. double degree, and a mathematics tutor. Oh, so, yeah? Woo. We're all going against. Okay, at least yes. I got the model correct. We got the model correct. I was almost there. Next question. So okay, okay, okay. Hazik has some pots in his shop. He bought another 4,293 pots on Saturday. He sold 2,148 pots on Sunday and was left with 4,645 pots. How many pots did he have at first? That was a pot full in my mouth. Dude, what are you doing? Everyone discuss. Debbie already has a finger on the bell getting ready to answer. As you can tell, the boys' group are pretty unified with Vincent overlooking. Oh, the girls have come to an answer. Wow. 4,500. The girls have came to an answer and the answer is 2,500 boys. Do you even have your answers yet? Nope, the answer is 2,500. Do not worry. Whoa. Don't bother trying. Whoa. We're getting fresh, guys. I'm just a cheerleader. <laughs> Whoa. How much is one question worth again? One question, one correct answer is worth three marks. I thought you had it. What were you doing? No, I was just telling me. It's okay, it's okay, guys. We got yeah. Yeah. Ben, yeah. Ben, yeah. ben, Ben, how do you feel? after being pressurized to being the best at math and not able to answer a single question so far? Uh, still okay lah. <laughs> you know, um, at the start I was feeling confident especially after we won the first one but I, it seems like they're, they're, they're back into their mode, the nervous, uh, nervousness has gone and for us it's just stress and uh, how, how many questions in this section do there we have? There are a total of eight 
Wow. 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 Let's, try, let's, try, let's try it again. It's okay, like, man. At least we get one more seven. Right? All right, girls, girls, girls. So far, you've been on a roll. How do you guys feel? It feels Jess. great. Jess. <laughs> Jess. 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 Jess is the one. <laughs> I, I saw how they worked. I saw Jasmine working on it and then Denise was working yeah, on it as well. The same answers, you know it's right. Yeah, they both got the correct answer. Whoa. So they have Whoa. a fail safe. Where did the book come from? It's part of my preparation and strategy. So I'm so sorry guys, but yeah, I, I can teach you all the question after this. Alright, question number four. This one, you might need to look at it pretty properly, alright? Three apples equals 30. An apple and two bananas equals 18. Banana minus coconut equals two. Coconut plus apple plus banana equals two question marks. You know, when he's reading the question, the girl's already stuck. 60, 60, 60, 60, 60. Find the value. 16, 16. Oh, sorry, sorry, what? What? 16, 16. Um, your, is your answer 16? Yes. 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 Huh, that was actually very fast, eh? Good job, guys. On the speed, but the answer is wrong. Ah, ah. Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Okay. Alright girls, who said 16? Who said 16? I was reading. Yeah, I was like trying to process it. Yeah, that's how it's 16. Who said? Come on, the answer is 17. Oh, it's 12! 17! No, it's 17 because of 15. Answer is... What's your final answer? 15? 15? 16? 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. Oh my! Oh. I don't think they know. Uh, Kevin... Kevin just saw it, but hold on guys. Alright, so the guys got 16 and the girls got 15. The girls got it right. Of course. Yay! Okay, uh, do you guys want to explain how you got 16? I don't know, you explain. You, you were pretty confident with it, huh? <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa! You were pretty confident yeah, man. with 16! Uh, 3 apples. Alright. 30, uh, so you divide by 3, so it's at 10. Okay. Then uh, 18, so 1 burner is at 4. Okay. Alright, then 4 minus 2. Just two, right? Okay. So two plus four plus ten, it should be sixteen. But then wait, okay. So that's how you got sixteen. Yes. So that's how you got sixteen. Okay, girls, how did you get fifteen? Oh my god. We noticed the bananas. bananas. The bananas oh. are missing one. Oh. Freaking oh. hell, man. Right. <laughs> this isn't a math question. This. <laughs> All right. Go. No, but but actually it is. So this teaches you that you must be very careful when you're doing a paper. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Guys, learn from that. Question number five. Where? Can you add a straight line to the following statement to make it true? Oh, like just across. Put the straight line, the, straight line, the whole question, just cancel the whole thing. Alright, the girls have an answer. Girls, what is your answer? 5 plus 5 plus 5 does not equal to 550. Technically, you are not wrong, but that's not the answer we're looking for. <laughs> oh, oh, luckily, never listen to you, Gabby. <laughs> so, boys, you have this man, man. Come on, this, come on, math guy, come on. We can do it. Yeah, it is a trick question. It's, it's not. A, yeah, it's, it's actually a, a trick question. It's, a math. it's more logical than maths. Ben, we didn't get the answer wrong. Close your eyes and draw a straight line. <laughs> just, try just try. Just do it, man. Just close your eyes, draw a straight line. Draw, draw. Faith. <laughs> all right, guys. For the sake of the show, you have ten seconds left. All right, girls, you wanna count down? Five. All right, boys. What is your final answer? Can uh, Chen, can you please show the working to the to the camera? <laughs> I'm not proud of it. I'm not proud of it. All right, Denise, can you please explain to the boys? So all you need to do is add one line here. <laughs> all they needed to do was just add the line on top of the plus sign. It becomes 545. Wow. Wow. Uh, I feel like right, Redon. If you make a bad joke. And then we ignore it on purpose. Don't say it again and waste our time. Sometimes, you know, like uh... Oh. Internal conflict. <laughs> 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 you might not wow. want this money, but I want this money, okay? <laughs> Just remind you guys, there's a thousand dollars on the line. Yeah, you happy with that? Yeah, are you happy with that? Alright, so girls, how do you feel? Where shall we eat later? <laughs> oh! <Yay>! Number six. <laughs> Jasmine and Jasmine and Juhi use $61.20 each to buy some followers. Jasmine has a 15% off promo code and bought 6 more followers than Juhi. How many followers did Jasmine bought? Alright guys, a little social media trivia we, for you guys. We, we need to know her follow. We need to know the amount of followers she has, right? This is the most intense I've seen both teams. Yo, just make some noise. Denise can't deal with noise. Guys, yo. Guys, yo. 
The boys Guys. have opted for a distraction plan because they can't really think straight. <laughs> Guys are better at math. Yes. Yes. Sure. Guys can count more. Yes. Yes. The girls are working in groups, as in like, there's three different groups of people working together and the boys are unified as one unit. Just to let you guys know, this is a PSLE question. This is a PSLE question. This is PSLE. Yeah. You know what? They, they shouldn't encourage buying of followers <laughs> in PSLE. Okay, that's all I can say. No matter how old you are, you should not buy followers. Especially if you're doing PSLE. Wow. That is a moral correct is answer. It? But what is the final answer? Since we don't really have a clue and we are not really that confident, but I feel we, we, have, we have a method of working it. Mm -hmm. It's. Just say it! Family friendly! Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> we are thinking the answer is 46. 46? You wanna yes. log that in? Lock it in. Lock it in. Lock it in. We're right, we're right. Alright, so the boys have finally came to a conclusion that the answer is 46, but the answer is wrong. Oh, oh, oh. You love yes. life, that's why you leave the love. You have one minute left, girls. You minus six first. Alright boys, I, I I think I think we should tone down on distraction. The she girls are left with 30 seconds. Followers, okay. So you minus six more. Sir, sir, sir. You, you want minus of five marks? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yo guys, keep it down! Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Alright. I know how much six followers cost, but I cannot count the number of Alright, the girls have finally came to an answer. What is the answer? Juhi! <laughs> TikTok superstar came up with an answer! I mean, Juhi should know, it's her followers. She would know, alright. Juhi, what's the answer? Is it 66? 66? Your final answer is 66? What was the boy's answer just 46. now? 46. <sighs> this is not the answer, but yeah, the answer is wrong. <laughs> the answer is 40. Why, really? Yes, so we are very upset because Trev got the simple answer at the start. If you play a flashback, Trev got it. He was like, yo guys, I think it's 40. Okay, we need to know her follow. We need to know the amount of followers she have, right? But then we had to overthink it and somehow we had 46. I swear, it's because that light turned off. It's yeah, because yeah, that light yeah. turned off. If that light did not turn off, Trev would have said 40. Yeah. But instead, he said, he said, <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so no one gets a point for this question. Okay, Alright, girls, how are you feeling? I, I, I could tell that you guys were really batting your brains out on that question. Okay, Denise looks devastated right now. How are you feeling, Denise? I need to go home and wait myself. Oh, 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 that's what Denise does at home. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we're going up to the seventh question. At first, John had some $10 notes and $2 notes in the ratio of 3 to 8. After exchanging two $10 notes for two $2 notes, the ratio of $10 notes to $2 notes became 1 is to 3. Find the amount of money John had. <laughs> I think this is the most intense we've ever seen the boys and the girls go head to head. But the girls still sticking to their tactics of having divided groups working to see whether they can get the same answer and the boys are all relying on one group. Oh, yes, sir. When you say after changing $10 notes for $2 notes, does he exchange with himself or he's exchanged outside? So it's like, you, you give me $10 and you <laughs> oh, oh, that was a dumb question. Alright boys and girls, you have 20 seconds left to answer. <laughs> Trev doing his own calculation, Kevin is also doing his own calculation. So now you can see a separate in a group. The girls are now unified, so it's kind of a twist in tactics. Are you, are you confident of your answer? It looks like Trev found the answer. No, no, no. You doubted yourself before. No, no. Why would you want to doubt yourself again, Trev? Really? And your time is up! Boys and girls! Can we just try? Alright, the girls just, just want to try for an answer. $120. <laughs> so much of Your answer is $120. Okay, boys, what is your answer? Ben, what is your answer? 92. 92. Alright, boys and girls, let me just tell you this. None of you got it right. The correct answer is $736. What's so much money? Dollars. Why? Why would we have so much? Alright, boys and girls, we're on to the last question. 
of this section, all right? How are you guys feeling? You you look more serious now, feel, honestly. I, I feel like we're pretty even this section, right? Yeah, yeah. Pretty, uh... I'm, I'm feeling frustrated. Uh, Why? The, uh, my mind is just not clear. And just like reading the questions and trying to figure it out. It's hard. So is that why you've been distracting Denise this whole time? Yeah, I mean, if we can't answer, then we got to make sure they can't answer as well. I'm, I'm just kidding. I've gotten it correct, but I made a careless mistake. What was your careless mistake? Instead of writing 46, I wrote 36. Ooh, <laughs> very, very simple careless mistakes made yeah. to the wrong so answer. How to, how to be yeah. Alright, boys and girls, we're on to our last question of this section. But let me just say this, alright? The girls are currently in the lead and if the boys get this question right you guys will end off section B with even marks because right now we stand at 21 marks and 18 marks okay, okay. I can do that I can do that no right. pressure no pressure no pressure now you know you're standing all right on to the last question of section B how do you make seven even without addition subtraction multiplication or division oh ho, ho, the girls before I finish my sentence, yes, Debbie, you look very confident. Take out the S in seven. You take out the S in seven? The answer is. Boys, do you, do you want to try? It? Do you want to try? It? No. I mean, it's right, lah. It's, it's right. right. The girls got it right. That's not a math question. <laughs> it's still math related. Alright. Okay. okay. So it shows that the girls team have definitely clawed their way through section B and overtaken the boys with 24 marks. And the boys still stand at 18 marks. Alright, guys, let's just say you do win. What are you planning to do with the 1,000 smack roots? Well, obviously, it's all on black. You no. stole my answer. I was gonna say that. I was gonna say all on player. Alright, so casino is the answer for the boys team. Girls, what are you planning to do with that $1,000? We're gonna have a nice meal. Yeah, we're gonna eat. And we we'll think if we should invite the boys. We we'll think about it. We are heading into Section C. So for this section, get ready because you'll be facing up against each other 1v1. Alright, so each student will have to choose a subject. And now within this subject, there are five questions. So both students will have to answer five questions each. And no matter how many questions they get correct, as long as the person has more points, they get the five marks for their team. So for the first couple going up face to face, we will have Hakim and Vicky. Alright, so the person on the table will get to choose one person from the team to help them with the question. Alright? Okay. Alright, Hakim and Vicky. Scissors, paper, stone. The winner gets to choose the subject. Scissors, paper, stone. Okay, <laughs> choose music before Abby can get music. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Music. Are, you sure? yeah. Whoa. Are you sure? Maybe. Oh, yeah, girl. Come on, just choose because it just. Just just do it. Do it. Okay, okay. Okay, I'll take music. <laughs> Hakim has chosen music. Hakim and Vicky, your first question for music is It is commonly referred to as the treble clef. What is the other name for it? <laughs> oh, oh my god. Again, then again. It is commonly referred to as the treble clef, but what is the other name for it? Alright, Vicky, who would you like to choose in your group to help you? No? No one to help you choose? I'm gonna say I don't okay, know. Maybe just we don't know also. Why are we both don't know? Just Let say out something random. You might uh, get an answer. Bass clap. Bass clap. Bass clap. Hakim got bass clap. Vicky. Vicky said no. Is what? Vicky, Vicky said no. Other name. Name. How many people is helping her? How many people are helping her? No, I told her. The, the no other name. It's called no other name. G, 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 G. Both of you G, G, G. are wrong. Oh, the answer G, G. is the G clef. Oh, wow. All right, next right. question. Okay. I'm sure. How many keys are there on a standard piano? I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Seven. You have to lock down your answer if you want to answer. Bell. Use a bell. 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 Valid if you want to answer it. Vicky has an answer. What is the answer, Vicky? 88. The answer is correct. Can we, can we like Even a xylophone who, has more than seven. Can we choose who's helping us before you give the question? Alright, sure. That's that's true, what Vincent said. You have to choose. Abby and 
Okay, Vicky chooses Abby. Hakim, who would you like to choose to help you with the next question? Uh, okay, I would choose Mr. Janelle. Okay, let's go. Alright. All right. Question number three. Which singer topped Forbes list of highest earning celebrities this year, making $185 million pre-tax? I know. Hakim, what's your answer? <coughs> Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande. The answer is wrong. So, thank you. Um, next. <laughs> Vicky, lock in. Lock in answer. What is your answer? Taylor Swift. Do you even know any of her songs? Never. Never say never. Vicky got it right. Taylor Swift is the highest paid celebrity this year. Highest earnings. Alright. Fourth question is. The didgeridoo, sorry, the didgeridoo, correct? Didgeridoo is a wind instrument from where? Hakim. Australia. The answer is correct. Why am I the only one? Okay, here's a fun fact for you. Hakim actually stayed in Australia for a few years, so he would know, right? Few no, years for a few months. Oh, uh, for a few months. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Okay. Face uh, false facts. Alright, last question for the music category. As of right now, Vicky has two correct answers. Hakim has one correct answer. So if Hakim does not answer this correctly, Vicky gets the point. Number five. What is the most streamed song on Spotify? I'll let you guys know. It has over two billion streams. Song, right? It's a song. Ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, Shut up, three, two, one. Wait, we got helpline? No. No helpline. All right, come up with an answer now. Vicky, ladies first. Three, two, you one. Look. No answer. All right, Hakim, your last chance. What is the most streamed song on Spotify? Okay, the most streamed song on Spotify is... Three, two... Justin Bieber, baby. Justin Bieber, baby. Oh, no, nobody. Oh, no. It's YouTube. Let you guys know that's the most watched video on YouTube. But it's not on Spotify. Because the most streamed song on Spotify is The Shape of You by Ed Sheeran. Alright, so for this subject, the girls win. Because Vicky got two correct answers and Hakim only got one. So five Sorry, marks go to the girls. Oh, no, 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 no. You got a didgeridoo, man. You're the didgeridoo guy. Right. Did you redo? All right, guys. So right now, the next students I want up against the table is Jasmine and Vincent. Yeah. 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 Going down, girl. Only upper down, upper down. <laughs> All right. You can only offer help to your team member for one question only. Vincent and Jasmine, scissors, paper, stone. Scissors, paper, stone. Nice. History. History has been chosen by Vincent. Wow, man of culture. So on the subject of history, the first question is, what year did Singapore gain independence? What? Okay, I need help. I need help. I need help. Jasmine, what is your answer? I don't know. 1955. What? 1955? No, 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 no. Sorry, but you already locked in your answer. 1955, it's wrong. Vincent, you have 10 seconds to answer. 10, 9, 8, Sorry, what's the answer? 19? 56? Yes, that's what he said. That's what he said? No, no, 1958. Both your answers are wrong. Guys, it's 1965, really? There was a movie, there was a movie about it. Why did I forget? No, every year we have National Day. That's how you don't forget. Jeez. Okay, okay. All right, forget. second question. Don't get a mark. Who was the first president of the United States of America? George Vincent. Washington. George Washington is correct. Oh. Very oh. good job, very fast. Yeah. One mark, no, no, no marks, but one point. I want to say Abraham Lincoln, right? Number three. Which country was Vietnam colonized by? France. The answer is... We. Yes. Wow. Which means correct. Yes, yes. That's it, yes. Oh, again. You got this, man. You got this. Vincent is smart in history, guys. Wow. I can't. Alright. Question number four. 
Who was the first man on the moon? Neil Armstrong. Vincent with the hat trick, it is Neil Armstrong! <laughs> By right, the boys team have already won because they got three out of five right. But for the sake of the last question, in what year did the first, the first iPhone come out? Okay, so we already won. Okay, let you answer. In what oh. year? Oh. Oh. Okay, come on, you can do this, Vincent. I already used my lifeline. I already used my lifeline. Lifeline, lifeline. Okay. Uh, uh, read what? Yes, hello. <laughs> when was the iPhone 3G out? Oh. 2009, I, I believe it's 2009. What? I, 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 okay. 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 All right. Oh. Wait, wait, so, so I technically win or you guys? Yeah, you technically win. Right. Right. Uh, I don't know, I'm just giving a random number. 1955. Ah. <laughs> 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 you are such a joke. Stop putting it in my face. You are such a joke. Show this at him, show this at him. He's dead mood. No rest. No this worries. this might just bite you in the butt, okay, Vincent? Okay, Jasmine, what is your answer? 2009. 2009. 2009. 2009. 2009. He says yeah. 9, you say? Uh, my lifeline. 2008. 2008. Both of you were actually close because the answer was 2007. Oh. Yeah. Alright, so the boys take this round. Oh. Oh. Before we carry on, Denise, how are you feeling? Because you've been fidgeting with your hands lately. My hands are shaking. I'm very scared. Mm. I don't want to let my team down. It's okay. Uh, it's, it's, okay, okay. it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. But those hands won't be touching the money. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next up, let's have Ben and Juhi at the table. Let's go. Right, let's go. Come on, ben. Let's go, Ben. Come on, Ben. You got this. You got Come this. On, <laughs> Alrighty, you know the rules. No discussion, only one lifeline for one question. Scissors, paper, stone, winner gets to choose the subject. Go. Oh, come on, Ben. Come on, Ben. This one never trained. Come on, never practice. Alright, Juhi, pick your subject. Science. Science. Let's go. Oh, man. I can be the lifeline. Our scientist. The first question for science. On the periodic table, what is the symbol for the element silver? I know what I meant. I know. Really? I know what I meant. Lifeline. Lifeline? Okay. <laughs> Who's your lifeline? Trev. Trev. Okay, Trev. What is the answer, Trev? AG. Yeah. AG. The answer is correct. Alright, the boys take the first question. The next question is, what is the only metal to be liquid at room temperature? Juhi? Mercury. Mercury is correct! They yeah. yeah, even have one all. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and we lost our lifeline. Alright, question number three. Who created the theory of evolution and natural selection? Lifeline. Oh. Uh, lifeline? Lifeline, Jasmine. Jasmine, what is the answer? Darwin. Sorry, say that again. Darwin. Charles Darwin is the answer. That's right. Oh. Come on, right, come on, you got this, Ben. You got this. Come on. Score is two is to one. Question number four. What part of the cell is commonly known as the powerhouse? This is my favorite question. Oh, Juhi, what is the answer? The nucleus. The nucleus is wrong. Give an answer, Ben. Ben. Ten. Very good. Lock in your answer. Brain cells? Lock in your answer. Oh, my brain cells. Ben answered brain cell, but the answer did not take too much brain because the answer is wrong. The answer is the mitochondria. Wow. What the? Last question. Okay, come on, Ben. For science. Last question. We need this. All right. It's either a point for the team, for the girls' team, or points for both of you. Question number five. When exposed to lower air pressure, does the boiling point of water increase or decrease? Increase. Ben. Increase. In increase. <laughs> well, the answer to this is just like your chances of winning this game. It decreases actually because the answer is decreases. Oh. So, yes, you have only one other answer which is... Which was? 
<laughs> decrease. <laughs> yes, the answer is decrease. So the girls take the science subject with three marks and <laughs> boys look pretty much devastated. Oh man, all right. Oh man. man. It's okay, man. It's okay, man. At least you got the first one right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, next up, let's have. Kevin and Cheryl. Yay. Don't mess this up, Kev. All right, Kevin and Cheryl, you know the rules. One lifeline each. Let's go. Scissors, paper, stone. And Kevin wins the scissors, paper, stone. All right, Kevin, you get to choose the subject. PE. PE. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, man. It's all theory based. So the first question for physical education is, what does NAFA stand for? You want to use your lifeline, Sherilyn? I see you looking back. Oh, whoa, 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 Kevin, the whoa. answer. Kevin, whoa. what is your answer? Whoa. National Aptitude Physical Fitness... Location. <laughs> hey, Kevin, out of the five words you have given me, only three are correct. You did get National Physical and Fitness. But the answer is wrong. Your answer is wrong. Sherilyn, you have a chance to answer. Nine. Eh. All right, and the answer is wrong. Both of you got it wrong. The answer is National Physical Fitness Award. Oh. Now, oh. The NA is from the word national. Oh. All right. Second question for PE. Which muscle in the body is the only muscle that is attached at one end? Tongue. The answer is tongue. The answer is correct. Uh -huh. oh, wow. The answer is the tongue. Question number three. How many meters are there in a mile? Sherilyn rang the bell first. Sherilyn. 100. 1.2 1. 1. 1. 1. meters. Why don't, why don't you play for me? <laughs> um, 1.2 km. 1.2 km, but I asked in meters, so your answer is wrong. Uh, one mile is approximately 1.6 meters. Kilometers. 1.6 kilometers. Yes. Yes. Ask for meters. Oh, 1600 meters. 1600 meters. That is correct. <laughs> Alright, question number four. Which part of the body are the gluteus maximus muscles located? Hey, 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 never use lifeline, right? You haven't used your lifeline, Kevin? Use Sherilyn, you haven't used your lifeline? I'll use lifeline. You use life, life, lifeline? Lifeline. Kevin will use his lifeline. Well, who's your lifeline? Hakim. 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 Dude, so, dude, dude. what, what ah? must... Uh, what part of your body are the gluteus maximus muscles located? Your thighs. Your thighs. Sherilyn, do you have a lifeline used? No. I knew you. No, but you know the answer? Who are you? We all knew. You asked the person that asked the one you asked the one person who didn't know. Abby? <laughs> Abby is your lifeline? Abby, this guy was like. Okay, Abby, Abby your lifeline. What is oh, your answer? Near the butt. I thought it was the oh first yeah. Both of you got close, but it's wrong. The answer is butt. Oh, your I butt. Don't <laughs> no, I, 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 I feel like showing my butt right now. Okay, <laughs> this guy, this guy was like, Kevin, I know the answer. Uh, Hakim. Yeah. <laughs> you literally oh, chose the oh, only oh, person oh, who didn't oh, say oh, anything. Why? Last question for physical education. Oh my, last question, you got this. What type of equipment does a spin class use? Come on. But Sherilyn. No, sorry, sorry. No, 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 yes, 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 <laughs> All right, so the winner of this group is the boys. Huh? As you know, right? So the producers have just came in with in some important news. Hold on. Uh huh. Sorry, okay. okay. Are you sure or not? You sure? Okay. All right. So the producer has um, came up with a VAR, okay, and said that they will allow electronic bikes. So the boys get five points. <laughs> All right, next up, we will have Abby versus Trev.
I apologize in advance. <laughs> yeah, come on. Come on. Scissors, paper, stone. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Trev. Yeah. Trev wins the scissors, paper, stone round. Okay, Trev, choose your subject. Okay, geography. Geography! Oh, no, no. <laughs> All right, so for geography, Mr. Worldwide, your first question is Which continent is the most populated? Trev, rang the bell first. Trev, what is your answer? South no. Africa. <laughs> Let me just say your answer went totally south on that. It's wrong. Okay, Abby, what Asia. is your answer? Asia? Yeah. Asia is right. Yeah. I'm sorry, man. Um, Trev. India. Oh, shit. Um, sorry, those are not continents as well. Yeah, those are countries. Yeah, but they're in Asia. Oh, oh gosh. Second question for geography. What is the capital of the Philippines? <gasps> Abby. Manila. Manila is correct. Sorry, man. <laughs> Holy what? shit. Third question of geography. This might be the make it or break it for the girls team. What okay, is the name of the different. second highest mountain in the world? Trev, answer first. Trev, you wanna answer or use the lifeline? The second highest. Second highest mountain in the world. Give it to the boss man. Okay, boss man. Ah. Alright, answer, what's your answer? And go. Let's start with a K. Oh, Why are you asking me a question? Ten, second, nine, eight, 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 no, 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 no. It, uh, I think it's... Um, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3... There's a mountain called Mount K? K? Mount K? <laughs> Wrong! Nice. Girls, you have a chance to answer. Can I use my lifeline? I'm not you can use your lifeline, okay, sure. Denise. Okay, Denise, what's the answer, Denise? Kinabalu? No, no, no. Yes, no, no. yes, she said it. <laughs> she said Kinabalu. Oh, shit. It is not Kinabalu. No. It is K2. That's what I, oh. Chenna was the closest. It's actually called K2. Oh. What is the full name for K2? Can someone please check? Godwin. <laughs> Alright. So no one got the answer right. K2 is also known as Godwin. Question number four in geography. What do you call an area where water flows over a vertical drop of series of... Whoa. Abby. I will finish my question. Sorry, what's the answer? Waterfall. Waterfall. Are you, are you sure about that answer? Yeah. You want me to finish the question? Okay. <laughs> Over a vertical drop of series of steep drops in the course of a stream or river. The answer is waterfall. That's actually correct. Yo, uh, yeah, Trev was just being a gentleman and wanted to finish, <laughs> let you finish. Yeah, yeah Remember it's what it's you like... said about like minusing off points when we interrupt you? <laughs> well, Remember that? Remember that, Mr. Holtz? <laughs> For the sake of the last oh, question. You yeah, you did, you did win already. But now you get to show it in their face like how Vincent did it previously. Oh, whoa. Oh. Alright, last question. What is the name of the biggest desert in the whole wide world? Sahara. Trev. Sahara. Sahara Desert is right. But still, <laughs> the girls took this round with five marks. Sorry, guys. Alright, alright, alright. Right now, we have the second last couple. Shall we have Debbie and Rani Siang? Rani Siang, let's go! Alright, boys and girls, you know the rules. One lifeline for one question, don't right? Don't choose English, because you're so bad at it. Scissors, paper, stone. Literature. Where do I choose this literature? For literature, the first question is, who is the author of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? Who's <gasps> lifeline? Yes, who? Uh, <laughs> Debbie wants to use a lifeline, or you want to answer? Rodal. Rodal. Do you never... You, do you use your life? Do you use your lifeline yeah, or not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was considered a lifeline. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Shall I answer Rodal? The answer is correct. It's Rodal. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. Question number two. What book are the characters Tweedledee and Tweedledum from? A book called Cat and the Fiddle or something like that. Is it no? <laughs> <laughs> That's a nursery rhyme, and the answer is Actually, wrong. Okay. okay, read one. What would you like to use? I use my lifeline. Your lifeline? Okay. I, Who's your lifeline? I'm pretty sure it's Alice in Wonderland. So your lifeline is Vincent? Vincent, yeah. what's your answer? I'm pretty sure it's Alice in Wonderland. Alice in Wonderland is the correct answer. Yes! Yes! Yeah. 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 That's right, that's right. Yeah. Okay, it's, it's all on you now, Reed. It's all on you. So the score is even right now. So, question number three. What is the name of the little girl 
in Peter Pan. Red one. Wendy. Well, I guess we know where the girls are not going to eat because Wendy's is the correct answer. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Wait, wait, gosh. Number four. Who is the partner of Sherlock Holmes? Oh, red one. If you answer this correctly, you get a chance to win this round. What is your answer? Harry. <laughs> Harry what? Give me a full name. Harry. Harry Watson. <laughs> he said Harry Watson. Debbie, what is your answer? Dr. Watson. <laughs> Can I just get a, a random first name? Oh, it's Ha. Drew? I don't know. The answer is... You know what? I'll give both of you wrong. The answer is actually John Watson. John. John. It's John. Oh, it has to be John. John. <laughs> Freaking John. All right, last question. Last question. Come on, we do it. For the literature subject. Come on, you can do it. Take it home, take it home. All right, complete this sentence. To be or not to be? Yes, we're done. You don't know this, I will slap you there. You don't know this, I slap you there. We're done. What is the question? Is the key. <laughs> the answer is wrong. Be or not to be? Uh, Debbie, what is your answer? To be or not to be is the question. <laughs> <laughs> the answer is to be or not to be. That is the question. But at the end of this round, Red One wins. <laughs> 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 Yeah. So, well, 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 another well, five well, points well. to the boys. Minus one because you just dab. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so, we all know who's the last couple on the table. Let's give it up for Tiano and Denise for the last yeah. subject English. Let's go. Come on, how? English, the hell out of it. Jesus, paper stone. Alright. It's a sign. It's a sign. It's a sign. First question is What do you call a word that reads the same backwards? And forwards. Palindromy. Whoa. Palindromy is correct. Whoa. Wow. What? 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 what does that mean? What's it? Very confident, girls. Team now. All right. Second question. What do you call a baby kangaroo? I know. I know. I know. Right. I said. Oh, Denise locked in her lifeline first. Debbie. Right. <laughs> Debbie is a lifeline. What's the answer? Joey. Debbie. Joey is right. Oh, girls are pumped up. Guys are looking very nervous. The third question, and possibly the last answer. What about the following sentence is incorrect? Irregardless of the rain, they were determined to carry on. Tian Hao. I think it's irregardless. The word should have been regardless. Irregardless is not a word. All right. The point is two is to one. Right. Number four. What is an adjective? Tian Hao. A word that describes. The answer is correct. One. Oh, oh. So the boys have caught on with two oh. points apiece. Oh. Oh. The last question. What does the word like a dicycle mean? Tian Hao. Lifeline. Life okay, Tian Hao has to use a lifeline. Who is your lifeline? You, you, huh? Like a daisical, like a daisical, like a daisical. Do you even know the meaning okay, of the word? I want, I want to know the spelling of this. L A C K A D A I S I C A L. But Tian Hao, you are extending your time, so you have 10 seconds left. Sorry, repeat, repeat. No, the cannot. I'm so sorry. Uh, There's like no 10, 9, 8. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Girls, no, sorry, no. It's not ten seconds to choose. I heard of this word before, but I can't remember the meaning. I'm gonna guess that it means something like a bit lazy. So we've got lazy. That's lethargic, right? Honestly, I don't, I don't know. I heard of this word before. I have it in my vocab book, but I really can't remember. She has a vocab book. <laughs> But then, technically, Denise got her vocabulary book just right now uh, because it actually helped out. It's correct. It's lazy. So, the girls take five points. Five marks. Yes, five marks. Alright, so at the end of section C, the score stands at the boys with 
33 points and the girls have a total of 44 Woo! points. So there's one more section to go to, section D, and this one is a real turnaround. The boys still have a chance in this game because the next session is going to have a lot of marks. So before we head into section D, how are you guys feeling? Um, I feel stunned. Like, I feel like... Yeah, I, feel, I, feel, I, I literally feel, feel cold after that. I, I don't know what just happened, but I don't even remember that first word that she said. Was it palindrome? Palindrome. I don't know. It sounds funny even <laughs> saying it. I know what's like a, what's like, like a bicycle. Like, but I like don't know what's like a disco, dicycle. Uh, my mind is blown by what, whatever just happened right now. So, Denise, how are you and the girls feeling? Um, good. I hope you are okay. <laughs> Yeah, you totally own that round, man. Palindromy took us all away. Girls, how y'all feeling? Yeah. I, I would like a double McSpicy, thank you. Alright, before we continue on section D, we have to bid adieu to one of our female contestants. Abby has to go off. Win it, girls! One last competition. Ladies and gentlemen, we have arrived to our last Section, section D, which is the impossible questions. Boys, you still have a chance in catching up because this is worth eight points or eight marks. All right, just remind you guys, a thousand dollar is on the line, okay? All right, and write your answers on the whiteboard and show it to me at the same time, all right? Boys, make some noise. Ooh. Ah. Who run the world? Rise and shine. <laughs> 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 ten points. <laughs> oh, okay, sure? No, 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 no. No, no, no ten points to do for Any point. other time I will give that. <laughs> Let's go with the first question for the impossible section. What is the twelfth letter of Trev's full name? Trev's full name. No copying each other. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. Bang. Hands down, show me your whiteboards. What is your answer, boys? The letter H. The letter H. Oh, they know. And no one gets points because the answer M, is M. 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 Because you see, Trev's full name. Yes. Oh. <laughs> what is the twelfth letter of I knew Trev's this be a full oh, name in the gosh. phrase? Gosh. I knew right. it's going to be party. Trev. I don't get it. Huh? So, thoughts, thoughts after the first question. You look very shaken. No, 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 no. I find this very funny. Amusing, amusing, huh? Yeah, then why didn't you say the answer <laughs> if you knew it? I'm not gonna make it easy for you guys. You guys are adults. Let's go. Question number two. And no one can ask It's impossible. Just think of it. Denise wants to study for three consecutive days, but she can't include Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. So what days can she study on? You have only one minute, guys. Just to let you know, each correct answer is worth eight marks. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and a one. All right, markers down, whiteboards up. Five, four, three, two, wait, wait, one. Wait, 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 boys, one answer only now. Minus one mark for the boys. No, 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 no. So girls, what is your answer? Two consecutive days. <laughs> two consecutive days. Boys, what is your answer? Every day. Every day. I don't even want to say it. Every day, and then sadly, none of us will get any question right, so we will just go ahead with 33 and 44. <laughs> just, Boys and girls got it wrong. Only. The answer is every day, every day. Oh, yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's a cheaper thing. It's like a, this one, this one, this one, but I don't know what. All right, guys, are you ready to go on to the third question? So, question number three A Ben is running in a race, he overtakes Vicky, who is in second place. What position is Ben in now? You got one minute to answer. Uh, both of you got the answers yet? Yeah. Alright, uh, don't have to count down then. Alright, lift your answers up now. What's your answer? Second and second. Wow, you guys are pretty confident. Huh? And for the first time, they both got it right. Because you only overtake the person in second place, means you're still in second place. Because there's one more guy in front of you. Obviously. <laughs> Alright, the second part to this question. Kevin is running in a race. He overtakes Ben, who is now in second place. What position is Kevin in now? You got one minute. <laughs> I don't, that might be the right answer. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. Alright, show your answers to the camera now. 
What does the girl have? What do the girls have? <laughs> first, what do you have? Kevin doesn't run, but if he does, first. She doesn't run, Kevin doesn't run. Kevin doesn't run, but yeah. if he does, he would be in first place. Well, I did say that uh, the answer had to be on the whiteboard, so the boys get the points. Because Kevin could never overtake Ben in a race. And Kevin yeah, doesn't run. Yes, doesn't run. So, yeah. Ke okay, Kevin, um, how do you feel? Uh, I want the guys to win, but it just kind of hurts. Yeah, it's okay. It's all man. It's yeah, 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 yeah. It's all about the $1,000. Yeah, 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 exactly, guys. Yeah. All right, fourth question. What word does Debbie always spell incorrectly? 30 seconds to answer this one. 10. I know you. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one. All right. The question is, what word does Debbie always spell incorrectly? The girls answered incorrectly. The guys answered <laughs> incorrectly. You guys are meant to be together. So it was uh, points to both teams. Uh, I don't want to be part of this feud, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> points to both teams. Question number five. Juhi's Juhi mom has three kids. The first name, Tick. The second name, Top. What is the third child's name? 30 seconds starts now. Wow. Ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Alright. Girls, what's your answer? I cannot see the answer. The answer is Juhi. Boys, what is your answer? It's Juhi. I think it's pretty straightforward. Both of them got it right! Alright, you guys will have fun with question number 6, alright? Rearrange the letters to make a word. There is only one answer. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, pens down. Girls, what's your answer? The answer is subtext. subtext. Oh. Guys, what is your answer? Oh, we don't even want to show. <laughs> okay, girls, enjoy your money. All right, the boys had no answers. So yes, it is subtext. So we are halfway through section D. Ready, on to the next question. If Sherilyn drops her blue pinafore into the Red Sea and then throws it into the Yellow River, what does it become? <laughs> Bo, we got an answer already? Yeah. yeah. Alrighty then, do it for a countdown. Alright, three, two, one. Oh. <laughs> wow, pretty confident. And both of them got them right. Ah. Alright. And you wanted to write blue. <laughs> <laughs> okay, question number eight. If you could write Ren Isyang's number of ex-girlfriends on your whiteboard, Ooh, okay, now you, you will get answer. 10 marks. Now you have to answer. Do you even know? Pants down, whiteboards, face the camera. <laughs> what is your answer? Ren Isyang's number of ex-girlfriends, Ren Isyang's number of ex-girlfriends. Yeah, I don't check see... Check for spelling, check for spelling. Check for spelling. <laughs> even though I don't see anyone's name, the answer is actually correct. What, what, I want you guys to write... Why is Ren Isyang's number of ex-girlfriends? Why is not like got no spacing? Huh? <laughs> Alright, both of them got the same amount of points. I think it's pretty much oh. equal when it comes to the impossible quiz. It's, it's pretty straightforward. Oh. Alright, last two questions. Which statement is correct? T1-T5's female uniforms have a blue shirt. The shirt of the female T1-T5 uniform is blue. Oh. Alright, time's up boys and girls. Please show me your answers. Girls. None. None because the shirt is white. Boys, what's your answer? None. None. So both of them got the same idea. Both of them get the same amount of points which is eight apiece. Oh. That's right. We have come to the point in the game where it is the very last. Question for the last question of class wars we have. You look into the classroom. You see two students kissing secretly. You turn away. But when you look again, you don't see a single person in the classroom. How is this possible? What? Uh, you, you guys Stay outside, outside the box. Stay outside the box. And time's up. Pants down. Are you? Show me your answers. <laughs> what did the girls write? Because they're not single. They're not single. Boys, what did you write? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, yes, we agree. <laughs> we agree. 
All right, so the girls answered uh, because they're not single, and the boys with their answer of yes signifies that the boys admit defeat. No, because we agree. We just agree. You just agree? <laughs> yeah. 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 agree. Yeah. Okay, let's just say you do agree. Let's just say you do agree. The final score will still be for the girls' favor. 96 points! The girls win the first game uh, of Class Wars. How many, how many points you got? Um, if you did agree with them, you would have gotten 88, but you only got 80. But technically, the, the two students kissing don't have, they could be single. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Oh. Where's, the, where's the establishment that those two are? Are in a relationship. Yeah. Those two are I in a relationship. I kiss people when they are not friends. Does it matter? Wait, sorry, Rina. Rina, can you please? Please, 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 no, no, don't kiss people when they're no, no, no. I just got word from the producer. Girls, you have won. Congratulations. But there's a big glutinous maximus, alright? In my hand, here I have two cards. Alright? Oh my god. Oh no, I see the word. I see what? words on the card. The cards here says steal or split. Okay. Alright? Everyone has two cards each. Alright. So there are two cards. There are split and steal. If everyone puts up split, the money is split evenly amongst all of you. If one person puts up steal and everyone else puts up split, the person who put up steal keeps all the money to herself. Ooh. However, Ooh. if two or more people put up steal, no one gets the money and it comes back to me for the next round of Class Wars, all right? Okay. Three, two, one, cards up. You're too nice, lah. Yeah. Hey. 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 It's pretty obvious they've been so positive throughout the whole game, spreading nothing but love and support for each and every one of them. Guys, you can learn to be more supportive like them. We know? are supportive. Yeah, hey, we, See, are we, support. agree. we agree. We agree. Yeah. Like, yes. You make yes. it. You make yeah. it sound like we're gonna steal. Yeah. 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 Who would do that yeah. among us? Oh. You think? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that concludes the very first episode of Class Wars. Boys, tell me how you really feel. I don't, I don't know, I think um, just that. Sorry, what's that word again? Pen, pen, Pandora. Palindromy. Yeah, pen, palindromy and like a, like a dicycle. I think they deserve it. They deserve yeah, it. I think they deserve it. Um, we tried, but I would say we had quite a few mistakes. Alright, so before I head on to the girls, um, let's talk to the man who's been very noisy throughout this whole game. Ben, uh, what are your thoughts? <laughs> You've had so much to say throughout the whole game. What are your final thoughts? Uh, I had fun. I had myself. And yeah, thank you for having me. A man of many words. Woo! Alright, so let's head over to our champions for the game. Girls! How are you splitting this money up? Huh? We're gonna have dinner. Can we get the box at least? But we'll bring the boys along. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, so they decided to split the money and bring the boys as well. So technically, dinner is on you, right? Yeah. Yes. So let's also ask the noisiest girl in the whole group. Vicky, what do you have to say? Um, I had fun. <laughs> oh, really? Okay, oh my fun. I had fun, yeah, that's it. Alright, my ears need to be checked because that was, ooh, that was so loud. Alright guys, so that concludes the very first episode of... Uh, Thank you.